low top or high top shoes. I'm a low top guy. I got flat feet, so it's hard for me to really roll my ankles. So supporting my ankles with high top shoes isn't comfortable. Low top, no question about it. I need that ankle mobility. Low top shoes. Say low top. So at least for me personally, I got really big calves. It's really hard to rock high tops with shorts, so I'm a low top guy, 100%. Low top shoes because I feel like I'm a guard in certain aspects, so I, com comfort is not there for me in, with the high top shoe. I'm going for comfortability. I feel like high tops are for more bigger guys. I don't know if you can see I got on the Kobe's. I always got to go low top. They're comfortable. They look much better. I'm team low top. That really depends. If I'm playing basketball, I want low tops, but I do like my high top Jordan ones. Really depends on the situation. I'm gonna go neither. I'm gonna do mids. I'd rather do mids. Probably go with the high tops. Too many ankle sprains in the past. It's tough. I'm a sneakerhead, so I go with both, but you know, to support the ankles, I'm gonna go with high tops. I prefer high tops. I like high tops. For some reason, a lot of people say high tops aren't swaggy, but I, I rock high tops and they be swaggy, so. Don't, I'm not here at none of that. Taller short socks. Short socks is my way of dressing this style. Uh, and not everybody can get it all. I say short socks. Medium socks. <laughs> I go medium. Tall socks, but scrunched up. So both. Just a tall scrunch. It's always a good feel, good look. Gotta go with the tall ones. Not really with the ankle socks. Tall socks when I'm hooping, yeah, 100%. Ankle socks and basketball shoes is not a good look. Don't let anyone lie to you. I like my socks high. I mean, I'm not against the short socks though too, but I mean, tall is just more comfort level thing for me. Gotta go with the talls. Gotta go with the tall socks. Tall. I like tall socks. No reason behind it. Just always been a fan of tall socks. Gotta go with the talls, but not too, not too tall though. Shooting sleeve or no. Another one, y'all see it. I might go with the shooting sleeve this year, so let's say yeah. I'm a shoe sleeve guy. Use that to really wipe the sweat off, you know? Shooting sleeve, easy. Every day, all day, it's the one. I'm both, I like the shooting sleeve and, and without it. I could do either or. Nah, no shooting sleeve, nah. No, I already rock the shooting sleeve. Uh, not really, because I go with the wristband around my forearm. Uh, it's my style and I think it's unique. I was rocking the shooting sleeve uh, two years ago. But uh, I would say no shooting sleeve. In college, I used to wear double sleeves, I one on each arm, but now, you know, you gotta show off the little muscles, so I'm gonna say no shooting sleeves. Shorts above the knee or at the knee? I'm going with shorts above the knee. I feel like I started that back in sixth grade, honestly. Definitely above. I mean, growing up, it was definitely at the knee, though, but I don't know what happened, but now it's back to above. Far above. I'm above the knee for sure. It's Give you more room to, you know, cooperate and, and get your moves in. So I'm gonna go shorts above the knee. Like right above the knee, but not like too short, not like back in the day short. I would say right above the knee. I'm gonna go above the knee. We're in 2022 now. I don't know what it is, something about, you got good legs, you gotta show them off. I'm like slightly above the knees. So I guess that counts as above the knees, but I don't want them short shorts. Above, as simple as that, Just swaggy.